What is up everybody? It's Joe from JL3 Games and I'm coming at you with another cool video back in the one the only Red Dead Redemption 2. I'm so excited to get back into it. It's been a couple days since I've played so I'm hopefully not too rusty and uh, hopefully I'm not as bad as I've been in the previous series. I I've done a couple things uh, so hopefully we're better. We, uh, let's get on our horse now and uh, when we left off I went into a completely bad place and uh, experienced my first death because i i'm dumb because uh, we have to we have a uh a wanted dead or alive area right here and we we're trying to get over here but that didn't work out so well because we're not very much welcome in that red area so i don't know if i want to start doing that yet i'm not good enough just yet so we might go to this this one over here thomas dons yeah let's go over here and do this first, um, because I'm not feeling confident enough with my, my, my ability of doing that one yet, uh, so, anyways, I'm absolutely loving this game, this game's absolutely fantastic, it looks beautiful, it plays beautiful, uh, very kind of, like, realistic as well, which is awesome, <clears throat> I love realism and, and games and stuff. Like, you gotta pay attention, uh, eating-wise and everything like that, in fact... Let's see. I'm actually going to feed my horse. It looks like we probably should. All right. Um, all right. We're going to feed you. Feed you, buddy. <coughs> Shire. I, I don't know if you have an actual name. Okay. See, much better. See, that helped him a lot. Now he's happier. Let's go. Okay, boy. <laughs> Gotta love uh, Arthur's voice. He's very... He's like the most... Like... He has the most cowboyish voice. Oh my goodness! Am I a part of this? What is happening? Holy crap! Oh gosh, careful, careful. Oh gosh, I'm so bad at doing on the horse at the same time. I'm not good at this. And I'm dead. <laughs> I don't even know why. Is that from the... Are you kidding me? Like, I was just trying to get to a waypoint. These guys just randomly start shooting at me. I don't even know who they were. Well, that's stupid. <laughs> I'm not good at riding on a horse. I can't multitask and shoot people at the same time. I'm so bad at that. Like, I gotta get better at that. Gosh dang it. And it costs me money every time I freaking die. Let's get out of here. Wait, do I have a, uh... I don't know if I have a bounty on me. I don't care at, at this point. At the moment. That was dumb. Alright, let's let's be careful not to hit other other carriages or stagecoaches and stuff. I don't want to do that and kill my horse. <laughs> I gotta get some uh, horse revivals. I, I think you can get them at the general store. So next time we're at the general store, we are gonna get some horse revivals because um, I don't want to lose my horse. Don't don't want that to happen. So we're definitely gonna have to do that. I can't believe I already died. Sorry. I was just saying how I'm not gonna kiss, kill my horse, and I run into a freaking tree. Wow. Come on, get it together! I'm so bad at this game. <laughs> I love it so much, but I'm so bad at it. <clears throat> That's what sucks. I wonder how many horses I'm gonna go through. Hopefully not. Oh gosh, this is. Where am I at? Why? Why am I going through this territory that's red? I don't want to. I don't want to be in the red at all. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, stay. Stay right there. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Where the heck am I going? Why? Okay, I'm just crossing through. Bounty of $10. What the heck? Okay, I'm just I'm just crossing through. So there shouldn't be I shouldn't be in it long enough as long as no one spots me in this one little spot on this trail. I'm crossing through the water and we're out of it. Okay, just making sure. All right, we're good. Oh, wow. Is my health down? Jeez. I should probably eat something. Jeez, whoa. What 
let's uh <laughs> eat some crackers. I need to eat some more. Um, canned sweet corn. Eat some stuff on the road. Uh, let's get our let's get our health. I hear firing, and I'm not very. I don't like that. And some baked beans. All right, let's go. I love these little bridges. You know what? I'm just passing through. I don't want any trouble. I just want to get the story done. That's all I want to do, okay? I don't, I don't want people attacking me. <laughs> Excuse me. Just keep me alive. All right, boy, I'm trying to try and keep my uh, horse. You got to keep him nice and relaxed. You don't want to overwork him or he'll, he'll buck you off, too, I've heard. I haven't had that happen to me, and I don't want it to, so. I don't know what I'm doing here. Is this more, uh... Oh, Mr. Downs! Okay, where's he at? Oh, I see to the right. There's a doggy. I... I... Looks happy to see me. Retrieve the debt from Mr. Downs. Okay. Where's he at? He's over in here. Okay. Whatever do you want? Mr. Thomas Downs? You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no. I'm, I'm, I'm... We ain't a charity, Mr. Downs. Really? Certainly, would you? <laughs> Please, I have a family. And pay up. I don't care about your family. Give me the money. To be more reasonable. Why did it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir, I didn't want this either. Come on. Threaten. You ain't such a do-gooder, are you? If you're running out on debts, I'm I'm not running anywhere. I'm I'm, I'm do. I'm, Come on. Please, please no. You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him. You took the money. He wants it back. What's not to understand? <laughs> oh, that was a big There's mistake. Money. I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife or your family or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> you borrow money, you pay it back. That's how it works. Thomas. What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman. My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us some money. I feel so like a like a bad person, but at the same time, you got that you have to pay pay your debt back. You don't just take money and not pay it back. <laughs> That's how it works. I don't know what's going on now, what we're doing for this one. Or what's going on now. But now we're running across a trail and I don't I don't know what we're doing now. <coughs> Oh, I guess we're back on the trail. Just some cinematic shots, I guess. Right, where are we heading now? Okay, so this is... Okay, so we're going to go back to Strauss here and uh, I guess explain what's going on. Or something like that. Oh, did I, hit, did I get you hitched? <laughs> I don't think I did. I don't want you rotted off, boy. There we go. <laughs> just want to make sure. I, I just don't want to make any mistakes. No mistakes for me. I like my new hat, though. Doesn't let you run in the camp. Okay, we're going to head 
back over here. Why'd you have to be all the way over here? <laughs> I know it's a beautiful view and all, but now you're walking even slower, Arthur. Come on! I just want to progress the story. Here we go. Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. That's it. Mission complete. Did that progress the story? Do we go up a percent, maybe? Yeah, we went up one percent from that. Let's keep going. Let's make this progression <clears throat> great. I'd love to get 15 plus percent today. Let's see if we can make it happen. But we gotta, we gotta do more. Come on, Arthur. We gotta run. Let's go. We got some work to do in in this episode. Let's do, let's make it happen. <coughs> All right, where are we heading next? Okay, we got this over here. We might have to go down there eventually, but let's do this one. I think this is a the same. Works for me. Yeah, let's get on the trail over here and start moving. <laughs> So pretty. I know I say that like every episode, but look at it. So amazing looking. Just running through these parts here. Nice horsey. Okay, watch out for these guys. I just, I'm just getting out of your way, as far as way as possible, so I can't come in contact with you. Excuse <laughs> <coughs> me. All right. Let's see what hosts say. Or horsey. I always call him horsey. I don't know. It just looks more like horsey to me <laughs> without the R. <laughs> I just like call, calling him horsey. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't book me off. Don't book me off. I'll, I'll slow down. <laughs> sorry, buddy. Let's get you some stamina in the back. Calm you down a little bit. Good little horse. All right, let's pick up a little speed now that we got some stamina back. Try and keep it nice in between here. Okay, we're gonna we're on this long trail. This tra this trail takes forever, <laughs> but we'll get there sooner rather than later. I can't believe I've already died twice now. So bad at this game. It'd be cool if we could get up to twenty percent in this episode. I, I I'm up for it, but. It's gonna be hard. I'm gonna try and get a lot of story done. It's the goal. I want to do some free roaming as well, but I'm gonna say I want to get the story progress the story. I want to get the story done. <clears throat> then we can do all the free roaming we want after that. An interesting way of putting it, James. Uh, no doubt. I do interesting very well. It's trusting I don't do so well. Please. I know how to work with good people, Seamus, and I work in the right way. We all say that. Hello. I never met an idiot that called himself one. Hi, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes this. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. 
Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves? To this clown? What are you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business deal. Hosea! Listen, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm you don't look that old. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Hi. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now you go get that. And then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? Go steal a stolen so you want us to take out the competition. Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin. By marriage, I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now you survived that. Where is he? Now he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmen de Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house. Oh. That's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. <laughs> Let's go rob his cousin. By marriage. <laughs> Good to go rob some people. He said not to kill anybody, though. So we're gonna do this nice and easy. Really? Really? Look where you're going. It's all right, boy. Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Let's Maybe. do it. You're the one who's been out gallivanting around here. That's huh? what you call it. Look out, Arthur. Okay, I, I need to go get around this house. There we go. And get back on the trail. Let's get let's get on the get on the trail. There we go. That's usually how it goes. <laughs> yes, but you know how this works. Come on, Hosea. <coughs> that feller's a joke. And that's why he's perfect. Hosea. He causes any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches. That's easy money for us. I guess you're right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus's old crooked cousin by marriage. We should hang up our hats now. You're all right, boy. Don't run into me, horsey. Uh oh. No, I accidentally pushed the wrong button. So, what's the story with that emerald ranch? You find out anything Oops. else? A little. Owner's a nasty type by all accounts. Seamus is sure scared of him. That's not saying much. Something strange about the place. Used to be a saloon there. What are you doing? General store. Now it's all closed up, but they seem to have money. Sounds worth a look around. For sure. Seamus also mentioned the rancher's daughter a couple of times. How he used to see her around all the time, but now she never leaves the house. Probably just sweet on her. That what you call finding out a little? Once he opens up. Seen hey, let's keep it down now. We must be close. <laughs> Didn't you finish the conversation? That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. Okay. Let's do it. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. Hosea. I'm following you, bud. There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Must have to be. Okay, let's take a quick look at the place. Okay, I need my binoculars. Oh, there we go. Anyone around? Yes. Okay. I reckon we can do it now. I'll head over, distract him by putting on a little show where you sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or wait until nightfall. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? Let's get it done now. Let's do it now. Sure. All right then. I want to get I want to get the stagecoach. 
All right, he's going to go distract him, hang back from Horsey, and sneak into the home. Okay, we got to wait till he distracts. Should I, uh... You're so slow, horsey. Horsea. My good man. My good young man. Very well, very well. <laughs> is your father home, sir? Sure is. Get him down. Please, get him down here. Get lost, mister. I was lost. For many years. I was lost many years. Nice, uh. You know what? Oh, <laughs> here he is. Are you? The father of the house. Sure. Pleasure to meet you. I was just chatting with Junior here a bit. <laughs> you selling something, Porter? I'm not selling, sir. I'm giving it away. All right, let's <laughs> get in the house. I was just telling. Uh, 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 oh, Junior. Search everything and and. Robert Crawford the third, sir. Different. Oh. I hope he can distract long enough. Both of you. My name. Well, what do we got here? Pocket watch. And quiet and stealthy. Alright, they're right out front there. Let's get this chest. Pearl necklace. Alright, good. I'll take food. I don't know how much time I have. Yeah, hey, we'll take some. <laughs> Alright, I don't know how much time I have. I hope you can <laughs> keep them distracted for the whole time. Oh, money clip. Now yeah, we're talking. Okay, we're gonna search the wardrobe. <coughs> Get to the barn unseen. Probably means I am running out of time. Search more. There's another drawer. Nothing in it though. Seriously, it's all about. Woo! They're right there. I only have fifty dollars worth. I was hoping to get more. I go in here, or do I need to go into? Wait for horse Horsea in the side the barn. I only stole fifty dollars and six cents worth, but oh well. Okay, we gotta wait for Hosea. Right here in the barn. And we'll take the stagecoach. Davis Overland Dis Dispatch Company. Hello, horses. Is Horsea coming? Or am I just going? I have no instructions now. <coughs> oh, there he comes. You done, Arthur? Yeah. Okay, let's grab this stagecoach and get out of here. Are you driving? Get on, dear boy. 
Who's driving? Yeah. Looks like I am. I don't know if they'll notice us, but here we go. Your chest was robbed! You're very, uh... You're very observant, son! Oh, they would have figured it out anyways. So I guess it's... <coughs> Sounds like it's a good idea to actually close drawers and chests when you're done. I'll keep that in mind next time. What's behind us? Oh, that's my horse. <laughs> it's like something's following us, but it's our it's my horse. Oh, sharp turn. Dutch has a new money chest stashed in a safe spot away from camp, but it's a long way from being full. I hope it's not stashed in town like we did in Blackboard. Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn there. I'm on it. Right into the barn. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. Mm. Park that thing in here. Quickly. Here's your stagecoach. Nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Yeah. Sure. I'll probably take us right back to the camp then. <coughs> Which is fine. I'm probably gonna have to somehow sneak into the the one place next. I have a feeling this is the last thing I could do before before I have to do that one where I already got killed. <laughs> I have a feeling. Easy. I'm. I. I I have no reason to go easy. Look at my share, 150. At least we're making some money now. <coughs> Excuse me. And how much money do we have? Whoops. $176. Alright, let's see what we can do now. Um, let me guess, that's gonna be the only one now. Yep. Okay, we have to go down and do this one now. I'm not looking forward to it. I wonder if I can cross the water right there and just stay on this red trail maybe a little bit. <coughs> so if I stay on this red trail and I have a bounty of $10, maybe I can go to the post office and pay that $10 off. I don't know if that's that will clear me on that or not. Let's put another one over here. Is it the same? Fort Wallace. Oh, that's the one we just did. That's where we just were. <coughs> See, it says to take this trail, but I'm I don't think I'm gonna do that. So we're gonna we're gonna stop by the post office first. 
I think. Um, let's see if there's anything I can do up here. <coughs> Lenny! Why don't we play Five Finger Phil? <laughs> oh no. I don't know if I want to. <coughs> it's unavailable at this time, I think is what it just said. <coughs> well, I don't know if that is, but... There's a lot of stuff you can do here in the camp, though. Contribute. Maybe we can uh, help out the camp just a little bit and upgrade some stuff. Give item, give money. Just give some money. <coughs> Let's give for, I don't even know, five five dollars. <laughs> Just to get us up a little bit. <coughs> okay, let's go down and uh, do our things. I feel like this is going to be the tough one. All right, am I am I to fourteen percent yet? Yeah, we've we've gained two percent already, guys. <coughs> All right, this one's going to be the tough one. Uh, I'm going to try and go the other direction and see if that helps. But we shall see. Let's go, buddy. <coughs> Excuse me. I need to just, like, focus on getting some money soon, too. I mean, we're close to $200. If that's anything. Alright, we're gonna take a sharp left. Yeah. Gotta cross the water here. <coughs> How good does the water look, by the way? I got a bounty of $10 on my head in this area. On this trail, it look, on that trail, it looks like. Interestingly. Oh, I love it. It shows the, uh, your gunshots, and I was right by that area, so I don't wanna be there. <laughs> I'm going to pay my bounties out. I don't know if I have one, but it says $10 right there. I don't know if I can get that one removed or not. Not entirely sure. But the area we're going, you're wanted dead or alive, you know, so I don't think there's paying that one off. <coughs> like at all. Which is the scary thing. <laughs> this, this one, this post office is near where we're going to be going, so... Oh, okay. You're gonna be that person, huh? Nice try. <laughs> That's okay. I'll take your dollar forty cents. Okay, boy. You picked a valuable. You can use valuable in crafting. Sell them or donate them to camp funds. Okay. What a little... What a butthole. <laughs> that wasn't very nice. Trying to steal my horse. I was just trying to be a nice person. He didn't get very far. <laughs> so. <clears throat> oh, gosh. Oh, there's hitching post right here. Alright, here we go. <clears throat> Horse bonding increased to level 3. Alright. <clears throat> skid turns and skid stops with this horse. Oh. Nice. Hello. Good to see you again, mister. I'd like to see if I have any bounties on me. I don't know if I do. I do. I have a $10 bounty. Let's... Don't worry. We'll contact our folks in West Elizabeth. 
Thank you. My na I'm so happy that my name is clear now. <clears throat> All right. We got to see which way we want to take now. Uh, to get down to this area. It's the only thing that we can do at the moment. <coughs> Story-wise, so... We gotta get it done. Like, like I said, I'm curious if I can cross here, but I'm not sure. I think that's, like, cliffs right there, so I'm not sure if that's gonna work out very well. Maybe I can take some of these, uh... <coughs> other trails here to maybe sneak in a little bit. I'm going to go here and to, to that trail there. and I want to go the other way, but I don't think we can discreetly. So I'm going to try and take the most discreet uh, kind of path that I can to get in here. If we die, we die. Uh, who knows how many tries this will take. Hopefully, I can get down there this time. <clears throat> this is some, it's just a dangerous place to go. I know that much. I wonder if I can put my bandana on while I'm in that area. Maybe that will help. Alright, let's see. Um, bandanas. There it is. I can. Okay. Maybe that will help. Maybe just the slightest. There we go. Alright, we gotta be careful in this area. Okay, so we can see Laman over there. That's why we don't want to go from that way. <clears throat> Trying to get over here. I don't... I kind of want to stay off the trail, though. So... I'm thinking about just heading left. Over here, straight to it. <clears throat> Staying off the trails. I think that's our best bet. I'm trying to stay away from people. All right, guys. There's cl Gosh, there's cliffs. There's a lot of cliffs in this area, too, which scares me when I get attention towards me. <clears throat> Those red dots come out of nowhere, too. It's like, dang. Okay, so far, so good. Last time, I didn't get noticed until I was right by the town place, so... We're gonna stay off to the edge over here and try and not attract any attention. Let's see where I'm at. All right, I'm heading straight for it. <coughs> Definitely want to stay out of the, the, the town, Blackwater. Gonna try and be sneaky. Look for any guys that do not want me over here. <laughs> Looks like a little campground over here. Yeah, I made it this time. <laughs> Good. There they are. How many? A lot. Uniforms everywhere. You see Sean? No. I don't think so. Damn it. Where's Trelawney? Who knows? Hi, guys. Keep your eyes open. I am. Hey. Where's that little Irish best? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Has anyone been in the black water to see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah. pictures of Dutch. I'll tell you. Oh, well, he got a lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's going to remain for now. Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. We want to trial him publicly. Gentlemen, hey. Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, <clears throat> then to a federal prison out west. Damn. Well, we can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or we'll cut him loose. I'm not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Skeldings, boys. I'm moving him to a camp nearby 
before handing him over to the government. So, I guess... We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. <clears throat> Let's go see. Oh, boy. <coughs> this is going to be interesting. Uh, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. Sure, well... We'll rescue Sean, and we'll get ourselves lost, good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. Okay, boy. Okay, boy. Alright, where are we heading next? Find the boat. Alright, let's see where it's at. Going to this area. Up here, I just came from there. Let's head up river and find this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkerton's. They got patrols out all over this area. Yeah, south of the river, West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place, right? Of course not. I don't know if putting my bandana on Stephanie helps, but... Bad as we feared <coughs> there, Arthur. I keep hearing about this woman, Heidi McCourt. Some young mother, they're saying, Dutch murdered on the boat. I don't know about that. I wasn't there. Bad day. Oh. And no money ah. yet, it seems. <coughs> I don't know where that is, at least. Dutch and Hosea say they do, but it's trapped in the town. Very careful. <laughs> oh, it must be wonderful to have such trust in one's parents. Mine would have sold me for a hog's head of ale. In fact, I think they tried. <laughs> okay, so get over here nice and easy. No issue. Alright, we're in the area that we need to be in. Where are you guys right. going? I think those might be our boys. Alright, gentlemen. Follow me. Following you. Keep your guns away until we know it's Sean, okay? I know what you two are like. Meh. You think they can see us? If they can, <clears throat> we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I'm missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of people to rob. Never. But without me, you'll not find the caliber of victim that I find. Maybe. <laughs> anyway, we should keep it down. Yeah, shut up. Let's go. Stay with me. <clears throat> you all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. Okay, are we there yet? Is that the boat we're talking about right now? Oh, I don't know, I just Pick saw the, up the pace a bit. I'm right behind you! What are you talking about? Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around <coughs> here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed. I know you can, like, shave in the game and everything, but I like Arthur's beard. I'm gonna keep his facial hair for now. <coughs> I might trim it up if it gets long. I, I don't know if it, like, grows over time. I think it does, but I'm not sure. <coughs> what are you doing? We're just walking around. Let's get to the fun stuff. <sighs> Still waiting on this guy. And he's telling us to keep up. And I'm like, well, you're walking really slowly. Look, they've stopped. All right, let's take a closer look. Binoculars, gentlemen. Gentlemen with the binoculars. <clears throat> I don't know where I'm looking at. Ah, oh, there they are. So who are these bounty hunters? 
I don't know too much about Ike Skeldon's boys, but I hear they're a big crew, and wild, built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep, that's definitely Sean. <laughs> oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. What? What's the idea? You're gonna tell us? Hey! Easy. Yeah, good boy. Careful. <laughs> Bumping horses here. Well, we're just gonna go down there and take care of these two, I bet. Let's do it. Take him out silently, though. I don't know what we're doing, actually, so... Couldn't take it. What's the plan, Stan? Do we have a plan? Let's do this quietly, if we can. Leave it to me, gentlemen. I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Do the dirty! Get your knife ready. Keep your head down. Stay here. Knife ready. Okay. Let's get in the river. Wait until he's got them off guard before crossing. I gotcha. You said to wait until to get. Hold up. He's doing his thing. Gentlemen. Gentlemen. Excuse me. Dear brother. My wife is taken ill. Gravely ill. What's the problem? Oh, what are you doing, Arthur? <clears throat> you say you're getting the one on the left, or I am? Wait for me! It a little longer than than he needed to be. Wait, what am I doing now? Just make, I have it from here, supposedly. All right, Javier. Wait, wait, what am I doing now? Do I need to get my horse over here? Or? Where'd the other guy go? <clears throat> oh, I guess we're going up here. Come on. We got two halfway up the canyon to deal with. Well, let's go. Do we need to be Who's the guy you got them from? Is he alive still? Do we need to be stealthy? Oh gosh. I guess we're not being stealthy on this one. Man, how many bullets can you take? <clears throat> oh, there's more than a couple. I thought there was just two guys. See, when it does the auto-aim, it's good to just, like, go up a little bit and get him in the face. Wait, I need to loot people because I'm cheap and I need their money and stuff. See, he had a dollar and eighty-five cents. Ah! Paying too much attention with the money. I love this. Boom! Look at that face shot. Face. 
Oh, dang it. Dang it. <laughs> there we go. Alright, where'd my hat go? Not without my hat. I paid money for that. <laughs> saying that they can blow your hat off. Got him. He's rolling around. Oh, there he is. I see Charles up there. Quick. Come on, let's get up there. Let's do it. Can uh, we got to go around this way? Give me your money. Dead body. Dollar <clears throat> 81. <clears throat> I'll take it. Hey, watch out for these two. Ah! I was not prepared for that one as well. <coughs> I'll help him in a second. Let me just get... I need to loot these guys. <laughs> Every dollar counts. And we're getting pocket watches and stuff, so it's, it's worth even more. Okay, $2.10. Look at that. I don't know what's the better gun to Come use on. right now, but... Take the left side, Charles. You go right, okay? I guess. What does that give me? Middle? Let's take these equal putas. Got a damn army of these bastards. How much is Charles found? Maybe we should put him in ourselves. Still time. Come on, Alright there. What are you doing, you buffoon? On top of the tower, who's got a Oh! Trying to get, to, I'm trying to do my best to get more headshots like that. Kill him instantly. Oh, I blew his hat off. Okay, kill him. Oh, a little too high, I think. There we go. Whoop! Hey, these guys are there. Reload, reload, reload. Ah, where did my hat go again? I keep getting my hat blown off. <clears throat> I paid for this money for this hat. I'm not losing it. Love how I'm just in the open right now. Gotcha. How many of these guys are there? I don't know, but I need to loot some of them. Let me get some of these guys' money. I gotta, I gotta get as much as I can. It all adds up. So and so. If more show up, I'll get, I'll get to loot more people. <laughs> so I'm okay with that. Oh, these rings. I, I gotta go to the store after this and just sell a bunch of crap. For real. I think I might have looted you. No, I didn't. Okay, there we go. It's a perfect time to loot everything and get as much as we can. Hey, what are you all doing? I'm looting everything first. Well, what are you? Help me out here. I'm coming. Hold on. Wait, wait. Wait, I gotta loot this guy up here. I haven't got him yet. <laughs> Hold on. Hang out a, just a little bit longer. And <clears throat> I'll get right to you. Hold on, there's another guy I haven't looted. I love how it, like, grays out if you haven't, uh, looted him yet. It's nice. It's that way you know. If you've looted everyone yet. Are you gonna get me down? 
Hold on, I gotta get money. There's another one up here, but I don't know if he's if I'm able to get to him. Probably not. Ah, uh, just forget. Ah, it's just one. I'm in no hurry. Good job. You know, you're a lot less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. Do I get a hug, Arthur? A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know, nothing means more to me than this game. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it. I would <laughs> happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to ride a Charles Adam stomach. I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. <laughs> You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm going to see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. Oh. <laughs> All right. Let's see what we can find okay, now. <clears throat> I've got stories for you. Yeah. I can't wait. I imagine you Let's get some life. more cash. The joy's back in your lives now. I need more money. There we go. That was the time to loot. Here comes my horse. Oh. Oh. Mission complete. The first shall be last. Let's see what we can find in here. Can I get in? Can I, like... Punch the door down. I don't know if there's anything I can do here. Come on! Looks like it's not gonna budge. Dang it! I was hoping there'd be some goodies in there. I don't know if there's anything else I can steal. I can move their bodies around, though. <laughs> That's not creepy. Crime report. Okay, I guess we're getting out of here. Get over here, horse. Horse, what are you doing over there? Let's get out of here. We don't have time. You're getting stuck. Oh, no. What have you done? Boy. Uh. Yeah. Okay, go. The crime's been reported. We got to get out of here. I was hoping to get some more stuff, but that's okay. Alright, um... We're out of that area, at least. Should probably... Okay, I already have it on. Never mind. We're just, uh, admiring the stream here. Okay. I don't know if I can cross here safely. Ah, there we go. Good boy. There's a trail right there that we can get back on. Okay, we're almost free. <clears throat> Beautiful. Okay. What is there to do now? It looks like we're heading back to the camp. Or is, no, that's not the camp. Never mind. Just kidding. Hosea Horseshoe. I thought it said Hosea for it. No, Horseshoe Overlook. Uh, secluded Plateau. In the Heartlands region of New Hangover Overlook. And, okay, let's go over that way for now. To go up another percentage. <laughs> I gotta know what percentage. Okay, we're at 15. 15% <coughs> completion on the story. Yep. Gotta get that story completed. I hate it when just random people are on the trail because then I'm just like, ah, I don't want to hit you. So I know I'm going to do it eventually. Okay, we're going to take care for our horse real quick. Because it's been a while. Let's go ahead and feed. There go, boy. Good, buddy. Okay, and we're going to clean you off. You look a little dirty there. Nice and clean. I don't know if you have to do it more than once to get it better, but. Alright. Good boy. 
You're a good, you're a good horse. You have been a good horse to me so far. And I haven't killed you like Randall. Poor Randall. Can we just take a moment to remember Randall? <laughs> he didn't deserve that death. I still have another horse too, even if, if something happens this one. I still have the Tennessee Walker as well. Another horse coming by. Ah, <coughs> uh, it's a train crossing. I should have beat it. That's okay. It's not gonna hold us up. Look how beautiful this game is. It's amazing. Good boy. Alright, so... Coming around here. Crossing the water. <coughs> and we're gonna head up here. Curve. I gotta pay attention. I can't look off or I'm gonna run into something. I was looking off for half a second. Can't do that. Oh, there's a question mark here. Like something. Like a side thing. I'm gonna avoid those as much as I can right now. I don't know. <laughs> Just at the moment. I don't know what they do. Or if they're important. They probably are. But we're just gonna keep going. Hey, hey, You've gotta help me out here, mister. Can you? Please. Uh, no. I've been on the run for days now. <laughs> I saw the <laughs> the convict uh, clothes and I'm like, I'm not trusting this one. Not this time. I don't mind helping people out, but not this time. I mean, I could have robbed him. I don't think he has anything, though. If he does, I would have been surprised. Well, he might have had something being, you know, broken out of jail or something. I, I, I don't know. Maybe he's been robbing people. Maybe he is the robber. Yeah, easy, easy. Look at all the horsies. Oh gosh, I hit my mic. Sorry if that was loud. Okay. We've made it this far. Hey, listen. I just wanted to say, I know you bastards missed me. <laughs> I'm sure we did. Even you, Arthur. Even you. It sounds like I did. Of course you are. Let's have some fun tonight. Let's enjoy ourselves. Are we having a party? Maybe. Yeah. Great. Let's have a party. I want to be part of the party. And don't worry about nothing, Mrs. Grimshaw. We'll have this camp running. Man, did you already drink a lot? I love you, bastards. <laughs> have fun. Have lots of fun. <laughs> Even you. <laughs> don't want to hear it. Hey, I thought there was a mission here, unless I, I'm not sure. Oh, that's where I went to. There's a stranger. Mission there. Oh, it looks like we're going to Valentine to celebrate. Or is that ba no, that's bounty hunting. Never mind. So we can do some bounty hunting too. Wow.
I'm not seeing any anything except for the stranger and bounty hunting <coughs> stuff at the moment. Health supplies. We a grumpy old bastard, Arthur. I just can't get rid of you, can I? Sorry. Mind if oh, I join yeah. you fine folks? <laughs> I suppose. You're looking lovely as ever, if I may say so. Oh, stop it. Imagine Don't riding with him all the way from Blackwater to here. Gang is celebrating something and something and something. Stew bowl. Can make some food. I don't know if I have any ingredients to do that. Singing! Let's sing. Call that singing? He's, he's like way out of sync and everything. What are you doing, Arthur? Arthur, you're not a good singer. You're so bad. I'm glad you're having a good time, Arthur, but it, that, that was pretty bad. Sorry. That was... That was really bad. <laughs> okay, where... <clears throat> did anything else pop up yet? All I see is the bounty. So anything else in like a st in part of the words that we haven't been yet? Since I haven't like obviously explored the whole map yet, but I feel like I have to go do this stranger thing now because that's the only thing there. <clears throat> uh, unless we're probably like on a, a break right now. And if you can tell the difference, you know what I mean. All right, am I still at fifteen percent? Yeah, I am. The, the difference between a sheep. And I, I feel like we're at kind of like a break point, so we can go out and do some stuff until something comes available. Will you dance with me, Arthur? Look at me. Yeah, let's let's dance. I ain't much of a dancer. Sure you are. Look at us dance, flare. Woo! You won't see Arthur. It's okay to dance. It doesn't mean we won't stop thinking you're angry and sad. So what you think of me? <laughs> sad in a good way. Oh, we can move around. A romantic poet. Well, that's about all I can muster. And flare. Woo! This is this is what we do now. Switch directions. Trying to be a good dancer. And there. Okay, one more flare and You're welcome. Okay. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. You're welcome. 
See, I'm a great dancer. Okay, why don't we go to the general store? I head over to Valentine. Maybe even do that bounty hunter or bounty hunting thing. I'm not sure. <clears throat> okay, boy. Let's go. We gotta go do something. So we're gonna go to town in Little Valentine, and I'm gonna head to the general store. I need to get some Horth revivals just in case. <laughs> so if I do end up hurting my horse. I can revive him, unlike Randall. Randall's time was, was too short. <laughs> and we can go check out the bounty hunting thing as well, because we haven't done that yet. I don't know if it's... I don't think it's part of the story at all, so... I'm, I, I, I don't know, but... We're going to go check it out. It's worth checking out, because we haven't done it before. We're going to see what we like to do, so... <coughs> We're going to figure it all out. Off to Valentine we go. I'm coming through. Watch out. Don't hit me. Love how you can kill these things by just running them over. <laughs> I should probably go, like, do some more hunting and stuff. I don't know uh, what a great place to go hunting is, but... Alright, let's slow down a little bit. <laughs> oh, look at that. Those mountains in the background. It's so pretty. So pretty. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, I see something on the map now. Is that that's not the bounty, is it? No, that's something else. What is this? Ah. What should you overlook? Letter. Oh, it looks like we got a letter has arrived for you. Uh, looks like it's part of the story too. I'm not sure. But let's go to the general store first, and we'll go check that out. Yeah, yeah. There's also another uh, mystery thing here. Should we check this out? What? What is the? I'm just gonna go raid a piece of people's houses. I'm back here. Oh, they're being bad. Let's get out of here. Oh, let's see. Oh my gosh. Why am I why are we watching this? Have I told you what an amazing love bird? But you are What are they doing? Let us be free and wild and bad my dear. Let us make love I don't think I don't think you're in a in the position to do that right now because you're just kind of okay. That's enough of that. I'm I'm going where I was originally. I don't know if that was part of the thing, but let's let's go and do what we were we we're supposed to do. All right, let's go back down here. Oh, watch the dog! Don't watch the dog. I heard killing a dog is not a good thing. In this game. <laughs> oh, it's in the saloon. Okay, let's let's check out the saloon then. The last thing we need is more trouble from you. Hey. Excuse you. I am not any way, shape, or form trouble. Right. I could barely even see you. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. Come on, sir. Try to remember. 
What really happened at Sylvia's saloon back in 76? Just a lot of bunk, Plato. It's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Calloway, sir. Who's your friend there? Put that in your fucking book, Plato. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway. Oh, yeah? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Lucy Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. <laughs> I want to deify him. He's a god. I'm trying to write his biography. How's that going? I think I prefer the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm going to write that down, if I may. Be my guest. <laughs> What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a gunslinger. Not really. I mean, folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame. <sighs> I don't think so. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money, sure. Okay. Then forgive me, mister, if I seem a little desperate. I am a little desperate. This book, I've got to make a thing of it, and, well... There's a whole list of gunfighters, legends, every last one. Emmett Granger, Flacco Hernandez, Billy Midnight, Black Bell. Never heard of him. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Ask them about Calloway. Any of them get uppity, shoot him. I can't believe I just said that, but... You want me to go and find some... Sad, deluded fools <laughs> like him. Ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get uppity, shoot him. Does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what I can do. Ha! Money! Oh, get photos. Okay. And there are notes on the back of those portraits that should lead you to him. I'll see what I can find out. I imagine we'll be stuck here upon your return. Here are some other flop house. Okay, so I, I'm guessing it's like a, some side mission, it seems like. Which is cool. Inspect the photographs, details. Oh, okay. Did I go to the wrong place? Here they, here they are. <coughs> so, we got photos of these people. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to do this just yet, but keep it in mind. Okay, boy. I'm still heading to the general store, which I still haven't got to yet. It is over here. <coughs> Excuse me. What, you ain't caused enough harm here already? What are you talking about? I if I can't just go into a town, to go to a general. I can't do anything now. I have to be causing trouble? What What if I'm just here to get some horse revival stuff? What if that's all I want? And you're over here like, causing so much trouble. I'm like, I'm not even doing anything. Are they closed? Dang it. It's too late. I guess we'll wait until they open. <laughs> until the morning. Well, at least that's an option. Did I sleep good? Where am I at? Huh. I even, am I by the hotel? Did that cost money? I hope not. Excuse me, sir. Some more provisions? Have a look around. Uh, let me browse your catalog. What you got? Um, hunting and fishing. Horse care. That's what we want. Uh, we got horse reviver. <coughs> medicine. 
Horse Reviver costs nine fifty. Jeez, it's expensive, but I care about my horse, so. Horse Stimulant. All right, so that helps with their health. I want to buy two for now. I don't want to buy too many. All right, what else do you have? Um, hunting and fishing. What other clothing do you have? Let, I want to take a look at your clothing. We have outfits as well. $85. Holy crap. Sure looks cool, though. The Valentine. All right, so those are, like, specific outfits. What kind of coats? I want to take a look at some of your... People have been talking about a curse in Valentine as long as I can remember. Some reckon this was Indian land once, but I ain't sure. All right, um, let's just take a look at some of these. I can actually go back and... Uh... You like the look of that one, huh? I don't know which one we actually have. <clears throat> we have our own, but... I just wanted to browse a couple and see if I liked any of these. This one's not bad. Kind of neat. Alright, how about some shirts? I'm going to take a look at some shirts. I don't want to spend too much money. I but... rock all the time when I was younger. Just don't have the energy no more. Show me the shirts. Oh, gosh. All right, here we go. Let's see. Like Let's that. take a look at all of them. We got that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. That one. <laughs> I kind of like the striped one. Maybe. Or this one. Let's see what colors they have. This one looks okay. Eight dollars isn't bad. I'm more of a red guy myself, but this this shirt takes me back to like uh, that low run days. <laughs> looks totally like an outlaw run shirt. Oh, wait, I didn't mean to do that. Oops, all shirts. That one or this one? Telling me the daughter at Emerald Ranch don't leave the house no more. Six seventy five. Let's do it. I'm gonna do this one, and let's take a look at some vests. And vests. Let's see what kind of vests there are. These aren't too expensive, so let's see all the vests that we have here. Ooh, we got some fancy ones. That's mighty popular these days. I like the fancy vests. <laughs> Should we just go simple for now? The traditional. The brown one makes the most sense. I wonder if they have bandanas too. I'd like to have a red bandana to match me. Let's see, this one's 875. Let's go with this one. Enjoy. It's traditional, but there's nothing wrong with traditional. I might get a fancy one later. How about pants? Show me the pants. We're like going full, full style here with some new. Uh... Seems to have your eye on that. Okay, let's go with the pants. That's what I think. That... Jeans. Seven dollars. I'll take these. Okay then. We're looking pretty good, aren't we? We can get boots. What accessories can we get? We like gloves and stuff. All right. Um. Let's see. Let's take a look at all the accessories here. We can get gloves. I don't know if I want gloves right now though. Taking a shot. Yeah, they just now. have gloves. At the moment.
And, okay. I think that's enough for right now. We've spent enough money on that. That'll be good for now. Let's see how we look. Look and good, my boy. Look around. <clears throat> that didn't see bandanas. I don't know if we can get bandanas yet. We might be able to later on, but for now, we've spent enough money anyways. Thanks. All right, we need to figure out what we're doing next. So we're in the town right now. We should probably go check out this letter, maybe. Yep. Ah, it's all the way back at camp. All right, is there anything else we want to do here before we, before we go? Go to the saloon. <laughs> All right, we're gonna head back. Where, where's my horse? Oh, I just, I just passed him. <laughs> Oops. He's just running around freely. Hey, what are you doing? Let's go. All right, excuse me, guys. Don't walk in my way or I'm going to run you over by accident and then I'm going to get bounty on my head and it won't be at and I won't be happy about it. <laughs> I still have a bunch of crap that I should have sold. Oh well. I'll do it later. Do it in a little bit. Going to head back to horseshoe over to look. Good thing is I have some horse revivals now. I got a new costume. Well, not costume, a new outfit a new outfit. I didn't get a new coat. They were a little expensive, uh, at least at the moment. <coughs> I could have got a new coat, but I don't mind the one that he has now. It, it goes with the outfit pretty well, so. Alright, so we're just gonna head back to Horseshoe Overlook and take a look at that uh, letter for now, I guess, because uh, that's like the only thing we have to do. Like, I'm surprised there's not... A lot of stuff coming up, unless I'm missing something that I should be doing. Possibly. I mean, I, I have the side mission that I can do right now, so. Oh, gosh. Who goes there? Draws weapon. Oh, gosh. I'm so bad at riding horses right now. Okay, I'm back, guys. <clears throat> Alright, let's go see what this is all about real quick. Well, whatever else is in store for us, Arthur, I'll tell you one thing. What's that? I can change clothing. It's old pleasure not to be freezing our balls off up in those mountains. <laughs> You're not wrong there. Be well. Yeah, it's a doggy. Where am I going? It shows right. Oh, letter. Oh, there's the shaving kit. <laughs> there it is. <coughs> That's hard to get a hold of. Dear Arthur, I've written this letter a hundred times or more, and I cannot get it right. It's me. You know, it's me from the bad handwriting. I know it looks pretty I good. When we last spoke. And I was going off to get married that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things, and I meant them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck, and, well, it's a long story and not an interesting one. But I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, <laughs> that ran with you and your associates in town, and I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again if you could spare me a little bit of your time. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. Yours, Mary Linton. Oh boy. Okay.
I go to shaving kit, do we get to like, okay, so we can trim. Oh, pomade hair. You have no pomade to apply. Okay. <laughs> you look all fancy. All right, if I trim, let, let's see what the options are here. Our length is currently 4 out of 10. I love how you can't go up. You have to let it grow out if you want it to go up. Hello, gentlemen. Should we trim it to... Let's just go down one. Just a little bit. I don't want to go clean shaven because art right, there looks good with facial hair. Oh, you can do all at once. Whoops. I mean, look at that. He do, he looks like a baby. No, we, we got to make him look a little bit manly. So we're going to keep him at about three right now. <coughs> Just give it a trimming. There we go. Look, he's looking good as ever. He's looking good now. Okay. All right, let's see. We can go and, um, sleep set bed. Um, you can change your wardrobe, too. I don't know where you do it at, though. Change clothing. <coughs> so I'm assuming I have, okay, hats. So we have all these hats too. Curses everywhere. So I bet if you lose your hat, I wonder if you can get it back here or not. Well, I didn't quite understand what the woman was saying. Kind of her being a bit of an idiot. I think this is his original hat that he had. We currently have this one. Well, if they match a person, we can craft hats too. Wow. Of course. Hats on horse. Oh, we already have a couple different coats. Oh, look at those. Wow. And you can go with no coat, too. Which is kind of cool. I haven't messed with the wardrobe yet. This is the one that we have. Black and hunting jacket. That looks cool. There's this winter one. I really like the duster coat. That looks cool. Let's equip this one. It's looking pretty awesome. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that. And you can save outfits too, which is cool. Okay, we got vests too. I should have went through these before I went and bought some, but... That's okay, I like the one that I have right now. Shirts. What kind of shirts do you have? Black one looks good. <coughs> Currently have this one, the everyday shirt. Can I change the colors of them too? A little, yeah, you can. It's looking good though, Arthur. You're looking good, Arthur. Man, we got you looking good right now. Oh, you have suspenders too. Chaps. <laughs> Do you have any boots? Oh, here we go. Bandanas. <clears throat> we got this one. Can we change the color of it? Doesn't look like it. That's okay. Gloves, weapon equipment, satchels. Spurs. <laughs> That's awesome. I have a cloth mask. Neckwear. Ooh. Neckerchiefs. <laughs> they look all fancy. Go without gloves. Weapon equipment. Gun belts. Primary holsters. 
Don't get a good view of that one. Okay, I think we're good for right now. <coughs> look at us. We are styling now. Look at you, Arthur. You you look um, you look amazing. Okay, now we got a couple things up here now. So we got um, John Marston right there, and then we have Mary Linton up here now. So we have that one, and we have a couple. We have a couple now. Let, since we're right here in camp, let's go ahead and take care of this one. Since it's just right here. Gotcha. Okay, thank you, Miss Grimshaw. You busy, Arthur? Hey, Arthur. Hey, what's going on? What do you want? Uncle told me something about a train. <sighs> what did he say? Mary Beth overheard something about a train full of wealthy folk rolling down through Scarlet Meadows just south of the state border. Yes. You need help with it? I ain't even sure about doing it. Come on. At night, not too guarded, it's perfect. Nah, I ain't thought it through. <laughs> you know, stopping a train, pain in the ass. Sure. But what if we could force a train to stop? <laughs> well, of course. We get a wagon full of something flammable, oil. Put it on the tracks. They see it. They know they either have to stop or die. Ain't no train driver wants to be cooked alive. That is kind of brilliant uh, for you. <laughs> and that is a real idea. I think that's the first time you ever had one of them. <laughs> Shut up. You might be the first bastard to ever have half his brains eaten by a wolf and end up more intelligent. So we're doing it? Yeah, we're going to need ammunition, guns, look real frightening, and some dynamite to open up the train. Dynamite. I have to say, I can't not wait until the online stuff launches. I can't wait to play with friends, and uh, I think you're gonna have your own character as well. I believe. <coughs> I'm not sure. Shack just over the border, north of a place called Dewberry Creek. Leave it hidden somewhere near there. This would be so cool. Okay, so now. That did nothing. I wasn't paying attention half the time for some reason. Because, you know, that's me. Okay, so we got steel wagons for John. Or blunt with the, uh, that image. <laughs> Excuse me. There's, like, options to, like, play poker and, and stuff like that. I don't even know how to play poker. I've never played poker before. I guess I can learn through the game. I might I might do it on like off screen or something and then maybe I can I can do that later, but <laughs> it's all, right, boy. all right guys, let's do this. Okay, so we gotta steal some wagons for for those. Wait, how many are there? One, two Is there just two? Alright, we'll get a Valentine and We'll get this one first, I guess, I suppose. Yeah. Alright, um, we are currently at 15% progress. I, I've been trying to get a decent amount of progress done for each one. I wanted to get over 15% in this episode. <laughs> Anytime I try to do more of the storyline, I always fail, because I'm, I'm really bad at the game, so... Because <laughs> we started at 12%. I've only gained 3% in this episode. The good thing is, that means more content for you guys, I guess. More episodes. This will probably take quite a few episodes to complete, actually. When I think about it. There's just like over 60... Is that an invisible wall? I think it is. But, anyways... There's like 60 hours of gameplay on this thing, and it's like, holy, holy poop. We're only doing like two hours at a time right now, so. I, I feel like the episodes have to be long, otherwise it's just gonna be way too many episodes. All 
And I think it's fair to do about two hours. It's not, it's long, but it's not so long, but I mean, it is long. It's, it's completely long, but okay. Do I just, just hop on and, and grab it? <coughs> or do I need to distract this guy somehow? Is there different ways we can go into this? Mister? Hi. I'm gonna get a bounty for this. I already know I am. I wonder if I can create some sort of distraction for this guy. I'm not I'm not sure exactly. Because this guy's obviously gonna see me. What you doing there? Should I just hop on and go? Or are you gonna leave? That guy should leave. I would love it if he left. But am I just gonna leave my horse here? I don't know if that's a good idea. He'll probably follow. Our horse will probably follow us. Alright, let's just. Oh, no, buddy. <laughs> Vehicle theft! <laughs> we do have a witness, but I don't know what to do with, about that. I don't know if I can get rid of him or not. Can I, can I leave these guys here and just, like, try and take care? I'm gonna get myself killed. Yeah? So did you! By shooting at me! Alright, the crime's been reported, so I just need to get out of here. Where did the... Wagon go? Oh gosh, they're running away from me! <laughs> get back here! <laughs> you wagon... They're slowly walking away. Let's go! I know I'm going to be wanted, though. Like, I'm going to have a bounty for this, but... Oh, well. I guess I got to head... Ca should probably start... Whoops. Start head backing... The Head back to camp instead. Because right now I'm just going wherever. Where's... <coughs> yeah, I need to go this way. Destination. Don't make me go back through there. I'm not going that way. I'm gonna go cut across here. I can't go back into the the town yet. Let's not fly off a cliff either. That wouldn't be good. Oh gosh. I'm gonna somehow kill myself. See if I can get my horse coming back. Crime report. Oh, gosh. Again? I, sh I should have went the other way when I darted away. I hope my horse is okay. Is my horse wasn't following me at first. Ah, oh, here they come. I'm going the wrong way. What the heck? It wants me to go through the town. I don't know if I can if I can hang a left here and go through the trees. I don't know if there's hill enough hills and stuff. I don't want to go back into the right, that way. Okay, so there, it shows that I could have gone that way. But. Where am I going? Okay, I can go this way. Let's just, let's just follow the road and keep, keep on trekking here. Yeah! Alright, that wasn't too bad. 
I know I'm gonna have a bounty on me, but hopefully it doesn't cost too much. <coughs> you know, I'd rather just pay off the bounty and make it easier instead of having to worry about killing witnesses or, or getting rid of witnesses and stuff. Because I can make that money back. It's usually not too much. I don't know how, exactly how much this bounty is going to be on me, but... Man, I, had, I ended up taking a little super long way. Because I went the wrong direction. I should have started going into a different direction. I should have put my bandana on, too. So no one would know it me. it's me. I, I should probably start doing that. See, you learn from your mistakes. We're in a hurry. Let's go. There's no stamina bar on when there's two horses on this thing. So I can just keep going. And my horse is just following us, which is good. Don't want to lose my horse. Hopefully I'm not too far away. <laughs> We got this and another one to get as well. This is taking me along a very long, <coughs> long way to get back. <coughs> Excuse me. Come on, we gotta get moving. We gotta get back to camp. No dilly dallying. Back up this hill. And up this hill. Oh, we're on the edge of that, that area. I don't want to... It's literally just that little skinny spot right there. Which is interesting. Okay, I think we're almost back to camp. I think we're almost there. Pretty sure we're almost there. Oh, our destination's over here. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. We need to go down there. Can I, can I back us up a little bit? Backing up! Backing up, watch out, horse! My own horse. Okay, we're gonna go down here. Looks like this spot. There we go. Tell John back at the camp that the wagon is in position. I can do that. No, I want. Ah, yeah, I want. <coughs> this is a map. Okay, so we didn't go back to the camp yet. I thought we were gonna go back to the camp, but we didn't go back to the camp. Oh, so there's two different wagons, and you only take needed one. Okay, I, I, I guess. I guess that's how it works. We're gonna discover a little bit of new territory. <laughs> territory here. Yeah. Going back too. Which is awesome. The more we can expand of the uh, the map, the better. I need to get that bounty off my head though. It's ten dollars again. stay on this trail for a little bit. Hopefully no one sees me. Okay, there we go. We're out of it. Alright, we're just gonna head back. Do our thing. Not sweat it. We're gonna we're gonna do our thing and hopefully get it up to sixteen percent so I can I, I feel I think I've been going up each episode by four percent each episode. <laughs> So if I can get it up one more percent, 
in this episode. That'd be fantastic, at the least. Because I feel like I've, I've been lacking on what I've been doing. Okay, hold on. Alright, we'll slow down a little bit. Sorry, buddy. <coughs> we'll slow down a little bit so you can catch your breath, horsey. Sorry I pushed you so hard. Oh, what's the smoke up here? Is it a chimney? Oh gosh, I need to pay attention to the road. Wow, that's so pretty. Look at that. That's so cool. That looks amazing. Alright, hidden down. Those mountains look so good. This world is huge. Huge, huge, huge. Look at that. That's just beautiful. How can you can't you gotta appreciate that <coughs> level of detail that the developers went with. Hello. Oh gosh, what's going on over there? I don't know what's going on. Oh, that's all you're gonna say to me? Alright. You wanna rob people? <laughs> Is that what you wanna do? I'll rob you. How about that much? Mister, I don't hardly know what to say. Thanks, I guess. You done me a service. Ah, oh, you're you're hey, good, man. The stage company's gonna write this off as a robbery anyway. If you can get in that lockbox, you can take what you want from it. But ain't stealing if it's already stolen. I guess that's so true. I've been told. Need a lockbreaker. I don't have one. You cannot steal it. I don't even have enough space. I I wish I could get in there. <clears throat> but I don't think I have anything to pick the lock, unfortunately. So Let's go, boy. <clears throat> I think we're just kind of stuck at the moment. Yep. So I'm I'm gonna have to leave this one out, unfortunately. Plus, we just need we need to start just to get back. That's what we need to do. All right, make a Yui. Almost. Okay, I think we're almost there. Just gotta go through the woods because our camp's in the woods. It's Arthur. That's right. It's me. Excuse me. What are you doing? What's it look like I'm doing? It looks like you're reading. And I am. Hey, how do you act? <laughs> Just making conversation. Just making conversation. Of course. All right, let's let's get over here. Oh, hi Arthur. Hi. All right, I'm in some hurt. Am I in the is it why are you going the wrong way? Where am I? Yes, I am. I, <laughs> I was going to the wrong way point. I'm like, whoops. We need to go this way. <laughs> Don't tempt me, you repulsive little maggot. I love you too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hey. I think your name is John. Hey, I, I did the thing. We need another man. Charles? I'll go get him. Meet us at the wagon when you can. Sure. 
See you sure. Later. Ain't that dumb. <laughs> Next time, let the wolves eat all your brain. Then you'll be a genius. Nice. Okay, so... <clears throat> Bounty, $10. Anywhere I'm at? <laughs> I, need, I need to find a post office and take care of that soon. I probably should. I don't want to get shot or, or killed. Ammunition... Okay, uh, what's our progress at? So, 16. All right, we're up to 16%. We did it. We made it to 16. Thank goodness. I don't know if I want to start this mission. I probably should. Probably should end the episode here, which I think I'm actually going to do. All right, guys. So, we're going to go ahead and end the episode here. For now, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. Nothing happened there. I just dropped my controller and... It's okay. It's all great. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe for more amazing content like this. And uh, we'll come back. And I'm learning a lot. So uh, I'm getting... I'm going to get better. I, I promise. Hopefully. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Have a great day. You have a glory tomorrow. And we'll catch you guys in the next episode. Thanks. And goodbye.